Mm. Damn, we had we had two alerts that we haven't heard in like forever. So <laughs> yeah, um, we could do a Dartmoor one really quick. The the one that I did was actually pretty pretty quick. If you want to do yeah. it, yeah, yeah, like, I have time. Not, I don't have to it's not the one that I. It's not the the investigation one. It's it's a different one, but it is pretty good. Uh, wait. I thought we were doing the investigation one. We can. It's just that one's kind of long. I'm fine with that. <laughs> Linda says do a sniper one. Hmm. Could. Also, I reckon... hmm. your friend says, what's, what's up, friend? friend? Yeah. Uh, just, just playing some gosh darn Hitman. Or more Hitman is good. <laughs> We'll go do that. We'll go do the investigation one. Yeah. Kill Miss Carlisle. Oh, this is the one that she's right there, and that's where. Yeah. I... Hello. Oh, thanks oh, for thanks. the follow. Me rip one two one four. Me rip. Me rip. Thank you. Uh, we do Hitman every Thursday for now. Uh, we'll at least have one more Thursday with Hitman. Um, we'll hit and... as many men as we can. I haven't had the pleasure. She just clams up when I try to get an explanation. Uh, and then... Yeah, Gendry. Hmm? Oh, I'm sorry. Go ahead. I mean, believing our mother dead is not exactly uh, good to spend the week. I don't remember what I was going to say. Go ahead. Like I okay. Myself. Um, Gendra said... I can't. He can't remember if we did the investigation, and no, we did not get to do the investigation last time. I did it on my own, just outside of the game, um, and I was like, "Oh, we should. I should probably show you guys this because it's it's pretty cool." Obviously. Yes, yes, yes. There's a great spot to knock him out, so I'll just go wait there, I guess. I can show you some of the rooms because they're pretty good. Mm hmm. This one's got a bear in it. Ooh. And some birds. Oh, they're they're alive. real. Let them out. <laughs> oh. Free them. Oh, uh, that guy's like. I cannot. Watch you. I should be them. able to. Yeah, you should. I know. To like spook a dude. Uh, there's also a little thing out here that you can do where you can, it's pretty, this one's pretty good too. <laughs> You'd make him take a oh, picture, picture and you shock her. And right when you take the picture, she's like <laughs> electrocuted. It's pretty good. Wait, uh, Carlisle? Like your target? Yeah. Or the oh. Carlisle. Ryan's like, huh? Really? <laughs> I want to see you, like, drop a chandelier on her or something. Right? Oh, no. It's right there. Hey, thanks for the follow, Grovesy. An odd resemblance to Madame 35. Hmm? That guy's got crazy eyes. Um, Sharon says, looks like the Continental from John Wick. And... Yeah. Uh, I've heard the, the comparisons for this mission to be compared to, like, Knives Out. Oh, I can see that. Which I've never seen, so. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Knives Out. That was a good movie. I liked it. I need to see it still. He needs to go outside. Just get used to Daniel Craig with a thick southern accent. Yeah. It's, um, a, little, it's a little surprising at first. You're like, <laughs> oh. oh. <laughs> uh, Grossy says, never seen this game before. The graphics are amazing. And yeah, they are really, really nice. The... Like, they put a lot of work into this. This is the PS5 version, but um, it looks, I mean, it looks just as good, honestly, on PS4. Maybe a little less uh, shinies and reflectives and lighting stuff, but it still looks pretty dang good. Mm -hmm. You also play in VR. Hey, and that's fun. Scream with the water. <laughs> hey, uh, no, we're... Yeah, the, the engine. Newspaper. Agreed, Gen uh, Gendra. The engine they made with this is greatly fantastic. What's Sixty frames per second, too. Splendid dynamics between the two. So he's actually going around and uh, pointing out clues that we're, we're going to need to find. Um, you can kind of already get started on that. 
like this. Uh, there. Oh. So the reason I know this one is because I, I just did this a couple days ago. Um. And right in front of me, the greenhouse. It's me. I'm right in front of you. He just turns to you. <laughs> Indeed. Indeed. <laughs> Yeah, be him and do the clues yourself. Yep. He's taking his time. Yeah. Also, welcome again, Spyro the Gamer Man. Spyro the Gamer Man, good to see you. Tell me the first odd thing that comes to mind when you think of the last 24 hours. Uh, let me think. First thing, don't think. Um, okay. Well, I'm sure I left 20 quid in my locker, but when I came in this morning, it was only a fiver. No, not percent. Yeah, at least there is some money in there. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Wait. That horse head on the other side. Uh, oh, I know. It's a unicorn. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Isn't there a thing with the, like, the cemetery? Yep. That was the thing that I was going to be like, oh, that, that one's pretty quick. Uh, but, okay. uh, oh, you can break off the horn? Yeah, you can break off the horn. <gasps> you should kill someone with the unicorn horn. We can kill oh, her with it later. Yeah. yeah. We have our... For those uh, joining who haven't seen a Hitman game before, we have to kill the, the person in red over there. And a lot of these opportunities like this uh, allow you to get close to them without being noticed. Do do do. Oh. And no one around, so we'll just do this. If you're dressed like there we go. Detective 47, you might as well act the detective. I suggest you go talk to the butler. Sure. It's me, a detective. The same one that's been walking around and everyone believes it. <laughs> the good news is I could pretty much walk anywhere like this too, so. Mr. Except Whitman, for the top floor. Are you ready to inspect the crime scene now? A absolutely. I am. Mr. Stafford, if you'll speak. follow me, sir. Sure. What did Look I bring on mirror. this one? Okay, good. I have a lockpick. Look at the mirror. Look at the mirror wall. Oh, I thought it went up higher. It's oh. much less impressive. Oh, I can't even I blend in. Point out, the current affairs surrounding Madame Carlyle are of a delicate nature. Oh. You may be familiar with the recent announcement of her death. You will probably learn that the staged funeral. Do we have the fish. Did we bring the fish? We didn't bring the fish. No, we did not bring the fish. Brought a lockpick instead. Ugh. Ugh. Their mother was in fact not dead at all. Does have to cut like find the kitchen? But uh, I believe we started this one in the uh, we did outfit. we did that <laughs> that is available outside for us I'll to leave. Her dead when I leave. Before you inspect the crime scene. I will tell you this. The case concerns the death of Mr. Zachary, Madame Carlyle's younger brother. He was hey guys. dead in his bed. Eddie's soldiers. <laughs> the door was locked from the inside, and a suicide letter was found in his room. Yep, nice. I get to work. <laughs> so that's why this man is just sitting dead in his room. Yeah, we kind of just came in here like, what happened? <laughs> <laughs> There's a dead man in here. <laughs> The dead oh, body no. of Zachary Carlyle, Alexa's little brother. Throat I wonder what happened to him, 47. Plant A locked room murder oh. mystery, 47. Spread I trust you'll get to the bottom of, of this. Around 10 last night. Talking you over, you, poisons, over you. 47. Yeah. That whiskey scan's easy to miss. We didn't use our camera at all. No. No. To be fair, I don't think you really used it in the other game. You don't Not have often. it in the other game. Zachary oh, you don't? Mm -hmm. for new I thought you did. Last night. Not exactly what you would expect from someone suicidal. Zachary oh, you've seen the standard side note, uh, note before, Merrip? Yeah. A sample of handwriting. It could be relevant to compare to other samples to establish its authenticity. Is this where we get the cane? 
So I found out you can just it's unlock a, a cane passage. after you master this, this level enough. How the door was oh, nice. Hmm. A photocopy of the floor plans. Somebody's been researching the secret ins and outs of Thornbridge Manor. I believe you've done a thorough search of the crime scene, 47. Maybe it's time to see the butler. I'm curious about the information he's prepared for you. Oh, Diane. Uh. Park A4. Mr. Fernsby, I'm done with the crime scene. Did you establish a time of death? Zachary died around... Oh, time. Well, that is a... <laughs> <Ooh. laughs> and Madame Carlyle and her security didn't arrive until this morning. That leaves Madame's family and myself as the only persons here when he died. And before you ask, no, I do not have an alibi. I was alone in my office at the time of death. Here is the material that I've prepared for you. It's a list of the possible suspects and their quarters. Hopefully that will help you keep track. <laughs> no, it wasn't me. I These don't have an alibi. And here the are the prime suspects. <laughs> Including me. <laughs> uh, <laughs> Marip, uh, the, uh, the one person that you saw took everyone out, everybody out with a fish? Oh, so hmm. how does one Not here. You don't get that type of gameplay here. <laughs> uh, we, we also did, did a the fish. This is our second time flying through this novel <laughs> on stream. Or perhaps you prefer searching the manor for clues first. Yes. This is the door to Mr. Fernsby's office. I feel like it's a, it's fun to be able to play these levels so differently every time. Yeah. And that's why oh. you can, ooh, um, you can kind of go crazy, or you can play it straight the whole time. You know. He was about to confess to the world that he and Alexa murdered their older brother Montgomery forty-six years ago. Oh. And apparently, Mr. Fernsby helped make the murder look like an accident. God, I look just like him. The handwriting doesn't match the suicide letter in his room, mm. proving he didn't write it himself. Oh. Painkillers. Lethal if you use enough of them. But not the poison used to kill Zachary. Of course, Madame Carlyle doesn't know that. Are you considering to frame the butler, 47? I could. Mr. Fernsby clearly didn't commit the murder, but I think you have enough evidence to convince Madame Carlyle he did. Yeah, Maybe so you should tell him you are ready to present your findings. Unless, of course, you want to do some more detecting, 47. <laughs> I, I would rather do more detecting. I know. I knew you'd be like. <gasps> With the saber? No good's going to come of it. Stick to your own kind. You mean like Chris? He treated me like shit. All he wanted to do was play his stupid video games. Never any romance. I deserve romance. Play video games Rosie, with him. Tell me what you did last night. I'm in trouble mm -hmm. all the time. <laughs> I, I spent the evening with Patrick. You play romance games. We met after dinner. And yeah. Went home at one in the morning. He said he needed someone real to talk to. When he looks at you, it makes you feel like the center of the universe, like a real princess. But now he just ignores her. Well, he's well, under a lot of pressure. He's an he's idiot. Staff. That's what he is. Did you notice anything out of the ordinary? Any strangers outside the house? No, uh, Spyro no, the Gamer Man, we do make videos mother. and streams. We, we make videos yeah. of our streams, and then we have other Let's Plays that we just put on the video, I think. That's, yeah, that, that, those we don't stream. Those are, like, edited and stuff. Yeah. Those are, those are a little fewer and far between because I, I put effort in those, but, yeah. And it's more or less a side project with those. Yeah. Yeah. Um, um, and then Merit, ye, so Joe's played some of this off screen just to, to oops, excuse me, so see sorry. what else to do, but like the next levels in the continuation, we have not. Yeah, we had just on finished, uh, what, what was the level that we just did? The, uh, the, the, the yeah, I think so. Uh, Either way, it's in China. Yeah, I we did the China the level, and that's, that is as far as I've played in this game. In general, so oh, hey, a wrench. 
but in between this week and next week you might play the china level again and get more yeah stuff i might I, I like to try to get some unlocks um because some of them are funny <laughs> and pretty good <laughs> a banana Ooh, and a wait there was a disguise in there mansion guard that'd be nice mm. but we yeah. we have detecting to do and we are detective because yeah. look at our we're hat. allowed to go like anywhere I am a banana. Ooh. You don't need those, but... That one is too bad. A fuel <laughs> cell? Yeah, uh... Was that fuel? Fuse. Oh, fuse. fuse. That's uh, part of the picture one. Mm. Hey, buddy. Ah. Busy. Hey, Eddie. Hey, Eddie. Hey, Eddie. What up, <laughs> man? <laughs> Do I have to take this bust? And <laughs> then just smack him over the head with it. <laughs> I feel like... Oh, maybe not him. Play the record player and Play like... the gramophone, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Sorry, I like this Ooh. music better. What was that? Quite the poet. Oh, God. Uh, that was a priceless antique. <laughs> well, I think he's just... Done? Come on up. Stand oh. up, buddy. There you go. There we go. Interrupted him. Can you tell me your whereabouts for last night? Oh, Professor. Oh, yes. Dreadful business with Zachary. I stay at the local inn. You see, I prefer not to spend the night here at Thornbridge Manor. My brother Gregory came along for a nightcap. Yes, me, Rip. Yeah, you can definitely have some electrocution fun times with the, uh, with the fuse. Head around half past eight. Anything else I can do to... Can you tell me about Zachary's behavior last night? I certainly didn't expect him to commit suicide. Sure, he was upset by his mother's supposed death. We were. But he seemed more engaged than usual. You should ask Rebecca. They had a long talk. Did you know that he hadn't left Thornbridge Manor in nearly 50 years? His plants, mother, and the staff were all the company he had. If that's all, I have a speech to write. Did you notice anything else out of the ordinary? You mean apart from the fact that we came here to bury our mother and she shows up alive and kicking? Zachary found dead in his bed this morning? Or perhaps that the planned funeral is still taking place and I have to do the eulogy? And mother will surely have strong opinion on it afterwards. I can't breathe. Excuse me. What a nerd. I'm just kidding. Um... Sparrow says in Hitman 1, you kill someone with a cake. I think I remember that. Mm -hmm. It's been a while. Uh, don't mind me. I can finally save over that one. There's no need for to go that crack. I'd advise you to... Don't uh, mind me. <laughs> it's a challenge. <laughs> oh, it's a challenge? Mm-hmm. Whack him with the paper. <laughs> yep. Anyways. Gregory and Kendra says surprise people some basic maintenance tasks <laughs> or tasks. Oh, you're wondering about my alibi, Mr. Detective. Well, no. um, I left Thornbridge around half eight for a pint with Edward. I wish I hadn't. <laughs> Quiz night at the inn. Oh, yeah. On the other hand, staying here with Quiz Zachary night at the inn? Sister and the wife sporting I know. You know, it's like an inn, like a pub. Pub. Pub in. The, the short of it, Zachary was very much alive when we left. I stayed for the last shout, and I was back here just. Was back here by midnight. I was gonna say, is he like <laughs> half drunk? Like, come on, dude. Back here. No, he's rich. An hour ago. I know. He's rich and British. That's just how they talk. <laughs> blame him. Only company he had was his rare plants and mother, who travels more than she stays here. Honestly, I can't say which is the bigger ball. He's better off dead. Is that all? <laughs> Not very thorough, are you? Excuse me, sir. You'd like to tell me? Nothing really. I'm just enjoying the show. <laughs> Our perfect mother obviously fucked up, didn't she? Faking her own death. You know, good night, she's Sharon. Nothing to us. Oh, have a good night, Sharon. I think she's scared to yep, have a nice night. Mistake. Thanks for uh, thanks for the raid. Yeah. 
this was a good night for it because this game is fun to keep playing so oh right the cigar box hey there Emmer, Carla, this lady can you tell Emmer. me where you were yesterday Emmer. surely i'm not a suspect i need to account for everyone well i spent the evening with my family but i got an awful yep, migraine and had to take to bed everyone can attest to that I believe I went up when the boys sat down for a drink around eight o'clock. Is that all? How did you feel about Zachary? I might as well be honest. His presence was always awkward. But how do you have a meaningful conversation with a man who only cares about plants? In my opinion, Alexa bears some responsibility for how this ended. She supported his self-limiting behavior by letting him live here. Anything else you want to know? Have you noticed anything else out of the ordinary? Nothing special comes to mind. Except, perhaps, I did get a feeling that Zachary was depressed, not just sad. I suppose he realized that he had no one with Alexa gone. Even Alexa must feel the pangs of guilt over that one, letting him believe she was dead. Then again, guilt isn't her strong suit. Uh, yeah, so far, uh, Mirip says, uh, that she's suspicious. Uh, what do you think, uh, so far, guys? Who do you, do you have any inklings? Mm, didn't she say, like, mm. a different time she... than the other two? Mm. You can face through walls, so. Rebecca Collin. <laughs> Can you tell me about yesterday evening? We don't really see much of each other, my brothers and I. I suppose it takes our mother's funeral to bring us together, and even then, it's not like we sit on each other's laps. Now, let's see. Patrick, Gregory's son, disappeared straight after dinner. You know, I think he might be in some sort of trouble. Edward wanted to go as well, but Gregory convinced him to stay for a few drinks before they went off for a pint at the local at a quarter to nine. I swear Gregory enjoys Edward's discomfort over staying here. I had a conference call with my New York office at nine, so I spent three hours on my laptop in my room and went straight to bed afterwards. I don't know about Emma. She did act a bit strange. Mm hmm? You know, I bet she was making lists for changes needing to be done once she gets her hands on Thornbridge Manor. Quite the shock she had when Mother arrived during breakfast. Is there anything else you want to ask me? Sure. Tell me about Zachary. Did he act strange last night? You know, now you mention it, he was a lot more chatty than usual. He wanted to know about my connections in the publishing business. Apparently, a friend of his is writing a book, which strikes me as very peculiar. I didn't think he had any friends. Is that everything, Mr. Whitmer? That's... Anything else you feel like mentioning? <laughs> That's mean. <laughs> I may be wrong, but I saw Mr. Fernsby, the butler, leave Zachary's room early this afternoon. Oh. And he seemed a bit startled when he saw me in the hallway. It's probably nothing. Oh, and one more thing. Please be kind to Edward. He can only take so much. Hmm. Is there anything else you want to ask me? That was it. Free the birds. <laughs> if I could, I would. <laughs> I know. <laughs> Genja's like, I wish I had a human to feed me. <laughs> <laughs> uh, there is a... this one. Important document. Unauthorized movement of funds and privileges. Hmm. Is there anything else in here? I forget. There's a bust we can take. Mm. Oh, the paddle! The I paddle. know the paddle's really good, but <gasps> we have nothing, nobody to throw it at. I know it's such a good item. Oh. It's really good if you throw that because it flies like a it, helicopter. Yeah. <laughs> okay. You, uh, don't mind me again. Let me just, let me just grab this. Let me just do this too. Hello. Oh yeah, this dude. Yeah, listen. They didn't notice. 
he he fell behind a table. <laughs> They're not gonna notice. What if I question him? Let me just grab that for you. There we go. Okay. They had the flamingos, I thought. Didn't they? What? Was there another hitman level with birds? There we go. They'll wake him up and it'll be fine. Oh, hopefully. <laughs> <laughs> Hold on. I also can do this. This was another. Ah, uh, dang, they're already gone. Oh, because we knocked him out. Never mind. Yeah. <laughs> All right, I'll just reload that. It's fine. For that conversation or something? Yeah, we'll no, have a conversation. Cue bald. Instead of, yeah, so he's no longer cue bald. I see. Oh. That wasn't a kill. I think that was just a knockout. I just right? knocked him out. You'd hit him with a uh, pool ball because it's a challenge. Calm down. Why are you all up in my face, Mister? Please. Oh, please get in his face. He looks like he needs to be punched. Look at what he's him. wearing. I I don't care. Calm Can't we interview down. him, or is he busy? He's busy. Yes, I understand. I'm sure we can come to some arrangement, but you really need to talk to Anthony. He's the man with the papers. I don't like him. Listen, you know who I am, who my grandmother is, was, right? Just oh. <laughs> exactly, exactly. <laughs> He's already fucking up. Okay. All right, come here, you. You little knucklehead. Carlisle, can you tell me where you were yesterday evening? Oh, shit, it's that sneaky butler, isn't it? He ratted me out. Elaine, give us some privacy. Oh. <laughs> okay. She's really tense these days, and the last thing I need is more hassle. I took that pretty blonde, um, Rosie, uh, for an evening stroll. Mm -hmm. I mean, how the fuck am I expected to cope for an entire weekend in this shithole? I'm bored out of my mind. So, is that it? What did you think of Zachary? Oh, creepy as hell. No ambition. Imagine deciding to live in a museum. You know, father says... Groves, you're absolutely right. <laughs> Every dude needs a good punch in or two in the face. I mean, this guy is leading on that poor... Ner or that mm. poor... Um, maid, and then he was just flirting with the other maid. High school me deserved a punch in the face, absolutely. I mean... I wasn't, an, I wasn't like a righteous asshole, but there's... I did stupid shit. I mean, yeah. Sure, we all did. <laughs> And then he's got like pink sweat plant, like sweatpants on, sweat with like plants. <laughs> sweat pants. <laughs> I'll play sweat pants on. <laughs> Don't. It's a good game. Is he gonna it's be suspicious? Uh, he, yeah, he's gonna call me out. <laughs> he's knocked out. Oh. I'm gonna knock you. He's uh, he's orange though, which means he's a uh, he will rat us out he's if a, he were to yeah. wake up. We could have just snapped his neck too, but oh well. You live this Bring day. Bring him upstairs sir. and throw him in the bin as well. <laughs> there is a bin over there. No, yeah. no, no, no. No, we've got a good paddle. run going here. I know. Um, I don't think there was any clues in there. Yeah, go behind him and donkey punch him. In the back of I mean, head. I could. It'd be really funny to smack him with a banana. Okay. You guys are making me do bad things. Ooh. Oh. He's an asshole. Drop the chandelier on him. Oh. I just want to see that chandelier fall. He's not under it. We can lure him under the chandelier. Yeah, we can. Oh, uh, coin it. Don't think that will uh, ruin this. See, even the rich go for coins. Yes, you are the man. What? I missed him. <laughs> oh, look, how, look how close he was. 
Wow, he's not reacting to that, like, at all. No. Like... He's just like, oh, wow, that happened. And my coin, thank you. <laughs> <laughs> wow. Oops. Oh, well. That would have been like... Turn around with your, like, mouth wide open, like, oh! <laughs> Did you see that? Gendra says a good PTSD moment in a supermarket at the end of the aisle, a shelf full of energy drinks. I just swept them all on the ground. My friend was like, what the fuck? Think of the workers, so I put them all back. <laughs> then he just <laughs> then he just laughs and was like, I was just fucking you, you shouldn't <laughs> Oh, jeez. You want me to kill him? No. Just... Wait, is, is he the killer, though? The murderer? I don't know. We gotta keep looking for clues, Ryan. Jesus. Oh my gosh. Um. There we go. There, did he get his do now? Are we good? Yeah. Okay. Let's see. Oh, we're actually going to leave him like that. Yeah, I mean, whatever. Okay. I mean, he won't wake up, right? No. He, he was clearly not the one because he was was having, no, having a night. Yeah. Yeah, and the maid was all... That is the door to Rebecca's room. At least he had a good night. I mean, come on. Yeah. It's true. I did not kill him. He was still he still had stars over his head. <laughs> yeah, he just threw a cue ball at his face. Uh, Newspaper. That's hacking. The log that Rebecca was in a conference call from 9 p.m. <laughs> I think we're just looking up information to be fair. <laughs> looking for a uh, a word document that says secret info on it and then opening it. Um, this one. There you go. Uh, I already got all the clues, so it's not giving me a countdown, but let's go ahead and just interact with painting. Uh-oh, she's having a meeting down there. It's no big deal. Oh, shit. It's fine. Don't they notice Patrick's not there? I don't think anyone cares if Patrick's <laughs> not there. Eh. <laughs> <laughs> uh. If we go in there, it's trespassing, so I don't want to get caught. But you can um, open and close the side wall. <laughs> yeah, they don't. They don't seem to notice that. <laughs> you open the side wall. The detective's there, and he's just like, oh. <laughs> <laughs> push the button back closed. Um. Oh, I think there was one more room over here. Oh, that isn't legal action. You need to move, Missy. Yeah. Bye, lady. Stop staring at me. How about a shiny it's a coin? It's a big room. You could just turn on the water. You're right. No need to waste Save my coin. Crazy. Well. Well, she came anyway. Look! The water is overflowing. <laughs> <laughs> and now you're just gonna be a little yeah. oh. <laughs> doing her job. <laughs> now she's gonna like wake up and be like, "Did I wet my pants?" Yeah, she's gonna be why like, am "Why I am I down? Why am I what? <laughs> I'll turn this off so no one else. <laughs> well, she came in and turned away from me like perfectly, so it was just like this. Okay, we're still gonna bite on that on that little clue. Great. There it is. The cane. It's illegal to pick up, but it's okay to carry around. A keychain pendant for the greenhouse. Oh. What's that doing in Emma and Gregory's room, I wonder? Uh -huh. Why is the key missing? Interesting. Yeah. Any guesses so far? Emma's very suspicious. Suspicious. <laughs> 
<laughs> uh, tub. Look at oh. that bathtub again. I will. Now this is interesting, 47. A letter from Emma's mother stating that Emma is the illegitimate child of Alexa's late older brother, Montgomery. And listen to this. She claims to have... That's pretty. ...witnessed Alexa and Zachary murder him. <laughs> oh my god, him. you ruined it. <laughs> that sugar well, will never come out. <laughs> <laughs> uh, no. Did we no. walk in here last time? We yeah, we did. We did, because we got the cane for sure. Yeah. All right. Um, there's, I think there's some more clues. I don't remember. Um, let me actually take a look at the map because it'll show if there's uh, pictures to take. Uh, doesn't look like it. Was there somebody else we had to talk to? Uh, we talked to a lot of people. I think so. I think we got most of the family. We talked to, well, you can tell oh, who has a I, room on there. I know what else we have to do. And this was, this is, we got it. We just got a clue of what to do. Okay. Oh, was she telling us when she was talking? No, uh, it's something that we grabbed in there. Oh, the greenhouse. Uh, the greenhouse. Get the unicorn horn. Oh, this butler's still smoking? Yeah, that butler is still smoking. Jeez. Smoking on the job. It's a long smoke break, mister. Pick up the soap. Uh, okay, if you say so. Wait. There. <laughs> All right, I will use the unicorn horn Good to kill you, our uh, person. Or there's another opportunity in there to do something else, but... Wait, I thought we had the keys. Yeah, we picked up the key. Oh, well, don't Isn't mind that me. On the left? Don't mind me, sir. Emma Carlisle in the greenhouse. How curious. Hey. What, you oh. can't talk to her? I said they let him stay here, but essence is sure Emma would throw him out first Hmm. Wait, didn't we collect this stuff last time? Broken lab equipment. It looks like it was recently used, though. This is a table mm -hmm. showing lethal dosages for the poison used to kill Zachary. Something is circled, 47. Female, age 65 to 79, 60 to 64 kilograms. Oh. Uh, I'd say Madame Carlyle is next in line for a poisoning. Oh. I've uncovered enough evidence to tell Madame Carlyle that Emma is the murderer. Quite the detective, 47. I'm impressed. You were con trying to go tell Mr. convince Fendi. us it was him. Unless you think there are more secrets to uncover. Are there more? No. She says that anyways. I know, I was just... Just you, excited. Just being you. I just wanted to be excited. I was excited. This is Hold a, on a sec. cute little. Now, <laughs> there is another thing that we can do to annoy her by ringing the bell a whole bunch. Oh, but, the dinner bell. Yeah, I'm gonna. I just want to see what happens. How easy that is, or if I have to remove the guards in order to do it. This will be good. Where is she? Oh, perfect. She's down here already. Yeah, she had her... Oh, wait, the meeting was upstairs. Where's mother? She's not here, so false alarm. No, no, no. I heard the bell. <laughs> Has mother called? No meeting. That heifer. <laughs> not the bell again. <laughs> There we go. There you go. Very well. No one but me calls for a family gathering. Hmm. 
Hmm. I was thinking about just killing her right there for fun. I was going to say, just chuck a bag of sugar at her or whatever. <laughs> no, you don't have to. <laughs> Listen to your sweet cheeks. Because <laughs> <laughs> of sugar, not because not I'm sexist. Very well. If you'll follow me, sir. It was a bad pun. Actually, it was a really good pun. It was a play on words that was yeah. really good. Because it would hit her face, too, so her cheeks yeah. would be literally sweet with sugar. Mm -hmm. The best puns are the ones you have to explain. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> this man looks like he needs to sit on a bag of frozen oh, peas. Oh, he is a very old man. Didn't you see it when we close yeah, he's... We did a close-up? He had a good... Oh, look at this. They're in oh, sync. Oh, wow. What a time. <laughs> Oh, what? sir. Look at her face. <laughs> and she was like, what a ball. I must get in front of her to talk to her. Yeah, you do. <laughs> where are you going, buddy? Where is he going? Oh, I know where he's going. He's, he's not trying to talk to her. Oh. We are to hold the Although she is on track now. She's like, ooh, okay, ooh. The, the, the trigger has been like, okay, hey, hey, send her upstairs. Hey. Go back to the last stair. Uh, we will. Thing? I'm no, stuck. No, no. I'm stuck. Oh, all right. Well, on the walls, see the picture? That's her. Oh, yeah. Hey there. Thank you. I mean, there's a lot of pictures on the wall, so that if I find someone I recognize, I was happy. <laughs> Sherlock <laughs> Gomp. <laughs> That's me. <laughs> okay. I'll wait for her in here. Ah, uh, yes, this room. Ugh. Don't worry. This was a lot easier than what we ended up doing. Your <laughs> skills have gained you access to the lion's den, 47. Mm -hmm. Now, go claim your reward. <sighs> okay. They're looking good, boss. <laughs> go ahead and save. Wins? I don't think they're twins. So, Mr. Whitman, oh, maybe. Reached a conclusion. Same face. Take a seat, please. Go ahead. I did take a seat already. All right, who is it, Katie? Or Ryan? Emma. Emma. Oh, we didn't have enough evidence to accuse Zach right now. <laughs> Emma. Your niece, Emma Carlisle, murdered your brother, Zachary. My niece? Emma is not my niece. She's my daughter-in-law. And your niece. Emma is the illegitimate child of your late older brother, Montgomery, who you and Zachary killed 46 years ago. That's preposterous. You asked me to find out what happened to Zachary. Would you rather not know? No. No, go on. I found a letter from Emma's mother, Jane, who was the fiancé of your older brother at the time of his death. She witnessed how you and Zachary pushed him off the balcony. Hey. She believed you did it to steal the Carlisle Empire from her and her unborn child. And she raised Emma to reclaim what she lost. Marry your heir, Gregory. Get revenge and secure the Carlisle Empire for her bloodline generations to come. Emma is the daughter of Montgomery and that local girl, Jane. She is. Well, the girl got it wrong. I didn't steal anything. I did what was necessary to protect the future of the Carlisles. Montgomery wasn't cut out to take over from father. All heart and no balls. Emma used the funeral gallery to speed up her installment as the lady of the house, seizing the opportunity to stage Zachary's suicide. She did her homework, used a poison from one of Zachary's rare plants. Found old floor plans from Thornbridge Manor to gain access to his room through a secret passage. That scheming bitch. More than you think. I found proof that she will try to poison you next. Well, I'll have to take care of that. Thank you, Mr. Whitmer. You have not disappointed. I promised you I would reward you generously if you solved the case. So, what do you suggest? Two million dollars. <laughs> I have never done the money. Can I say I can save here? Kind of want to see yeah, what happens with money. money. I can get rid of that too. Get the money. 
I'll send you an invoice. Thank you, Mr. Whitmer. I trust you'll see yourself out. I need some privacy. Oh, that's it. Do I get a... Thank you. Do I get a, a challenge for that? No. Oh. Aw. Um, remember that first uh, uh, assassination that we did with uh, that old man? Um, we ended up poisoning his drink. Mm-hmm. Um... We, uh, there, so there's a couple times you can do that. You can actually slam his face in the, the little steel, uh, tower in front of him. Oh, geez. <laughs> Straight yeah. up Joker him. <laughs> All right. I want the file you have on Arthur Edwards. Edwards, the constant. But how do you... Oh, I see. I expected you might show up. But to kill me, not help me. But I've been wrong on so many things lately, so why not this one? I will give you the file on Edwards. You've earned it. I don't so you don't have to I kill her. Convince you to deal with my daughter-in-law now. You're oh no, <laughs> we still gotta kill her. her oh, it's our job. It's, Hitman's not gonna be like, oh, never mind. I'll have to see to it some other way then. I mean, well, the she... idea is that we need to get the case yep. file but yeah i guess technically we need to eliminate her too yep the file you want there you go god i hope you get edwards and make him hurt i need some privacy thank you as always oh, i thought you were going to throw it at her let's think about it <laughs> you were doing it as she slowly walks out of the room. That's the file on Arthur Edwards. All right, so I really should have been a little further ahead of her. Hi there. Hi. Because uh, there is another way that. So this whole room in here, the secret room. Yeah. Uh, if we kill her in there, there's a challenge for that too. Oh. What's poppin'? But I mean, like, when does she ever go in there? Dude, so I was gonna knock her out and drag her in. <laughs> oh, I... that's what you mean. You should go in there next, you said? I don't know. Unless it's like a thing that happens after this, like... No, she's going away. I'm gonna go back. Uh, let's see this one. Probably I'm gonna have to go to bed soon. That's fine. Uh, well, it's this is almost done. So once oh, okay. we once we kill her, okay. that'll that'll be the end of it. Nice. I want the file you have on Arthur Edwards. All right, we're gonna have to sit this this, this again. But yeah, How do you... I should also oh, probably. Is she really hungry? <laughs> I expected. Oh, you're hungry. Show. Yeah. So I will me, eat help. something after this. I've been wrong on so many things lately, so why not this one? I will give you the file on Edwards. You've earned it. I don't suppose I could convince you to deal with my daughter-in-law now you're here. I would like to see her dead. No. What am I going to eat? Um, I have some leftover ramen. I, to see to it some other way, then. I got um some ramen and takoyaki. Oh, nice. Uh, yesterday. Uh, I ate the takoyaki because that does not reheat well. Um, no. But then I ate about uh, half of the ramen, so that should be good for four bed. God, I hope you get it and make him hurt. I need some privacy. Thank you. In <laughs> Also, Merrip, yeah, there's a nice, the, the, nobody seems to notice that he's always bald, and, um, It's pretty funny, it? yeah. Yeah. He's also got, yeah, the barcode and everything. No one, no one cares. Somehow. Whoa! 
Tony, no! What happened? Ha! <laughs> what? Perfect. Now I'm a hitman. She's only knocked out. Don't worry. Uh-oh. Oh no, the window's cracked already, or broken. This is Alpha 3, how copy, over? This is getting Alpha scary. 3? Yeah, they think they're cooler than they actually know, are. All right. All right, we need to just get her in there. Yeah, you need to hightail it in there. Oh, that uh -oh. poor... Well... Whatever, it's fine. She's okay. Do do do. Drop her! And just a one of those. <laughs> oh Jesus! Time to get the file on Arthur Edwards. We did. Or did we? Alright. No, we did. <laughs> I don't know why she oofed. Was <laughs> she was good. knocked out. <laughs> yeah, I guess. Oh last No, front. I mean like this it doesn't make sense. Don't worry about it. There's m more pressing issues in there. Um, there, there she is, Ryan. Yeah. I'll do my usual. Oh, there's been a terrible accident. <laughs> yeah, there's gonna be a few bodies to find in there. Thanks, Farnsworth. Burnacle, Worcestershire, or whatever. Fernsby. Fernsby, yeah, thank you. Fernsby. Nobody actually knows how to spell Worcester. Worcestershire. Worcestershire, Worcestershire. Is, I think, like, yeah. Um, You can find the Hearst keys and then drive it away. I We did oh, not in this. Yeah. Damn. It's pretty good. Is there a kitchen in this place? I feel like with everything else around this. Yeah. It was uh, where the, the. Uh... Oh, that girl was. Never mm -hmm. mind. Okay. Can I just walk out? Yes. This is my car. You see. Everywhere. Go get out. It's the Constantine. Shit. No. Actually, I'm kind of surprised you don't have the car keys to that. Yeah. <laughs> It should just be in my pocket. Yeah. Trying to. Oh, we didn't kill her with the horn. Sorry, Ryan. Uh, Can we kill oh. one of the guards here? Nah. No? It's not the same. I know. I mean, yeah, maybe like tuck it at their face. Oh, God. <laughs> You've been unicornied! Like a narwhal tusk, too? Or was that a real life thing? Because I know that was a real life thing. It was a real life thing. Okay. Oh, we didn't get the flamingo. Oh well. Oh no! Yeah, we could have done it's a okay. lot more with that. Oh well. I had a rush because <laughs> it is bedtime. Cue ball. There we go. <laughs> yep, see? <laughs> Hell yeah. Again, there's that rush for <laughs> Shire. <laughs> Shire. <laughs> I'm a chiropractor. What? Breaking backs. Mm -hmm. Ooh. <laughs> I don't know. Breaking backs. All right. That's going to do it. I need to go to bed. Eat yeah, something. I'm tired. Um, yeah, I got Thanks for joining, bored. everybody. Uh, we'll be back on Saturday with... Um, Continuing with uh, the Legends of Kyrandia, book two. Uh, if you want to see oh. our the first book of that, um, I have a YouTube. It's Hump Comp. Uh, there's a link to it on my Twitch. Um, and Were you uh, try yeah. to raid. What was that? Oh well. Were you gonna... the one person I was going to raid raided me? So. Oh. <laughs> I could yeah. see if someone else is around. Um. Um, 
But uh, yeah, thanks uh, thanks for watching, everybody. Oh, and Tuesday, we got <laughs> we're starting uh, Jedi Knight Dark Forces Two, which has live action cutscenes, and they're they are pretty good. <laughs> <laughs> Um, so hopefully see you then. If not, uh, have a good night, everybody, and we'll, well, maybe see you soon. Have yeah. a nice night. Bye-bye. Okay. Bye. Bye. Night, bye. Everyone. bye.